Hello everyone, this is Varun from 499. Here in my hands are the new Galaxy S24 series. The entire lineup is here. So here is the Galaxy S24 Ultra, which is packing an all-new titanium frame. And here you have the S24 Plus, and here you have the tiny sibling, the S24. Uh, all the three devices also pack Galaxy AI, a host of new AI features which are part of uh, the new Samsung Galaxy S24 series. So let's find out in this video what else these new devices offer. The star of the show is the Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra, powered by the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 and sporting the all-new titanium frame. The flat 6.8-inch display packs the all-new Corning Gorilla armor protection. It feels great in the hand and the new 50MP telephoto sensor packs the quad tele zoom system. The S24 Ultra continues the legacy of the Note series with an S Pen and some cool nifty tricks under the hood. Next in line is the Galaxy S24 Plus with an aluminium frame and a slightly smaller 6.7 inch display. On the camera front it only packs 3 sensors, the 50MP wide angle, 10MP telephoto and 12MP ultra wide. The 200MP sensor is exclusive to the ultra like before. Both the Galaxy S24 Plus and the S24 feature Corning Gorilla Glass Victus 2 protection for the display. In terms of performance, the S24 and S24 Plus are powered by the Exynos 2400 in India and several other markets. Only the US, Canada and China get the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 variant. The base S24 model is the entry level of this S24 series and it packs a 6.2 inch display and a 4000mAh battery and 8GB of RAM and it's glad to see Samsung still keeping the compact flagship trend alive. Other than the battery and the screen size, not much is different between the S24 and the S24 Plus. What really impressed so me were the AI features including live translate, an interpreter uh, and also the generator uh, edit. Uh, so let's watch a quick demo uh, of these features. Which you use during phone calls and this one would be more face-to-face, person-to-person interaction where you're speaking to someone that is different, you know, speaks different language than you, uh, and it's able to interpret whatever you say, whatever they say in re real time. So, what languages support it? It supports 13 languages uh -huh. coming out of the box. There are 13 of the most used languages in the world. Mm -hmm. um, so, maybe you can pick one that's more suitable for you. Do you want to try? Maybe Spanish. Spanish? Yeah. Which Spanish? Uh, Spanish, Spain. Spain? Uh -huh. Okay. So you can speak here in Spanish mm -hmm. and I, I'll speak English then. Okay. Is that all right with you? All right. Okay. So um, when you're ready, you can just press mic button here mm -hmm. and start speaking. Hola, como estas? Hello, how are you? I'm doing very well, thank you. It's been a very, very busy day, but I had a lot of fun with many media people around the world. Lo estoy haciendo muy bien. Gracias. Ha sido un día muy, muy ocupado, pero me divertí mucho con muchos medios de comunicación de todo el mundo. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so in fact, we can do this all over again on airplane mode. So wow. the entire feature is done on device, Galaxy AI. So you won't need any Wi-Fi connection or any kind of telecom connection, right? Cellular. So let's say we do this all over again. Mm -hmm. um, how about I start first? Mm -hmm. start okay. First, yeah. So what do you think about the event so far? Did you have a lot of fun today? Entonces, ¿qué piensas del evento hasta ahora? ¿Te has divertido mucho hoy? Sí, muy bien, gracias. Yes, very well, thank you. You captured this beautiful image, but you don't like how the reflection looks. Simply with the built-in AI, you'll just click on that I button. It'll analyze the photo and give you suggestions on how to enhance the photo. So you'll just erase the reflection right there and automatically it disappears. And then we have our before and after. And then you would save from there. The next portion will show you have this beautiful image here, but the shadow is just ruining that perfect image that you would like. Simply with the built-in AI, you'll just press that I button again, and it'll give you the suggestions to erase the shadow. 
Once you press it, it automatically takes it out for you. So here's your before and after. And then you would save from there. And then the last feature, which is my favorite, using generative AI. Say you wanted to see this skater in midair, but you took the picture too late. So with generative AI, you would click on the pencil. You would use this Galaxy AI stars. And then you would just outline the skater. It'll capture it for you. Hold down, and you can place them anywhere you'd like. <laughs> You can enlarge him, you can turn him around. You can also get rid of this lamp post if you didn't like it. Just click on that button and the eraser and it deletes it. And then also with the scale, you can also alter the angle. So maybe you want it a little more straighter. Using the generate button, the AI will fill in those gaps for you. And it typically takes about 10 seconds for it to generate that data onto the cloud. Yeah, I know, that was pretty cool. There you go. Wow. And, and so you have your original and after. Apart from the AI features, the vapor chamber on the S24 Ultra has nearly doubled in size for better heat management. The display has better outdoor visibility um, with Vision Booster. Here I have with me Ranjit, Tiki Ranjit, as you guys might know. So let's pick Ranjit's brain. He's been using the phone for quite some time and we are at an event after a long time together. Few minutes, not yeah. quite. <laughs> so we thought let's uh, kind of share our thoughts and mainly. Uh, so what do you think Ranjit about the S24 Ultra lineup? Ultra, I would say the first thing I notice is the, it's lighter. So that titanium thing or whatever, definitely the weight has reduced and it has become a little bit more boxier. Mm -hmm. That's what I like too, yeah. You liked it? Yeah, I like the boxier feel. <laughs> the boxy design. So if you like that boxier design, you like it. And it's all about AI. Do you agree? That? Yeah. Uh, one feature I liked is mm, slow motion. When you take the video, you don't have to shoot it in slow motion. Mm -hmm. uh, you can just tap and it translates. So, so I think they're using some AI processing AI there too. So again, a lot of AI and I like uh, quite a few things are being done on device instead of every time just going to the cloud. I think so, you also experience Yeah, I think you can put in airplane mode and still use translation, which is kick ass. So yeah, I think so. Finally, that AI revolution that we were talking about on device is started on the phones. Yeah, which that's is the great. big thing. That's yeah, the big, big thing. thing. We've been always seeing it in, mm. in like enterprise use cases, end user cases, I yeah. think we're going to see only now, which is amazing. So which one is your favorite pick amongst the S24 Ultra? The S24. I would say size wise, I like the S24 Plus. Mm -hmm. But uh, might be using this one because I don't know the battery life and all those things. That is yeah, something. Yeah, but I think even I am in leaning towards the S24 Ultra because of the telescope cam the camera. Yes. Tele the Tenex cameras telephoto. have changed. I don't want to comment too much because here we shot, but the cameras have definitely changed. So it will be interesting to see how they perform. But also I think this is going to be I think the top selling one for sure. Yeah. And they look a little bit brighter mm -hmm. also the screen. And I think they are using some tech on the F24 Ultra. Yes. Uh, I think they are conning Gorilla Glass. Uh, armor, armor. Or, armor or something. It's a new one. It's uh, exclusive to the S24 Ultra yes. for now. And uh, one thing I noticed is that a lot of glare is there. But it is like reflecting the glare. A lot better. I think it's especially in India during summer, yeah, we'll know the true test of it. We'll know that. Yeah. But, so anyways, uh, anyways, thanks man. Thanks for uh, coming Ranjit. Yeah. Thank you. So that was a quick look at the Galaxy S24 Ultra, S24 Plus and S24. Let us know what you think in the comments and also what you think about the Galaxy AI features. See you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.